everyone. So, today I want to talk about the upcoming Samsung Galaxy S25 Ultra, which is dropping on January 22nd. There's been a ton of buzz and leaks about it, and honestly, it's kind of exciting to see what's in store. I mean, leaks can be a bit hit or miss, but when they come from credible sources, they definitely get you hyped, right? Now, let's dive into the key features. First off, this phone is rocking the Snapdragon 8 Elite chipset. Like, wow. That's gonna really amp up performance across the board, no matter where you are. Whether you're gaming, streaming, or just scrolling through social media, it sounds like it's gonna handle everything like a champ. And let's talk about the display. It's a 6.8-inch Dynamic AMOLED 2 LTPO. I mean, can you believe that? It's got a 120Hz refresh rate, HDR10 Plus support, and a peak brightness of 2,600 nits. That's insane. Just imagining how vibrant everything will look makes me a little giddy. You know, those bright, colorful images are just, they're everything. Moving on to the specs, they're offering some solid memory and storage options too. You can choose between 12 gigabytes to 5, 6 GB, 16 gigabytes, 512 gigabytes, and even a whopping 16 gigabytes, 1 TB. Seriously, that's a lot of space for all your photos, videos, and apps. And the charging capabilities, they've got 45 West wired charging and 25 West wireless charging with Chetu, PMA, like no more waiting around for your phone to charge. That's a huge win in my book. Let's chat about design for a sec. The dimensions are 162. 8 by 776 by 8.2 millimeters. And it weighs in at 219 grams. When you compare it to its predecessor, you can really see how they're refining the design. Plus, they've enhanced those wireless charging features, which, let's be real, is just a really nice touch. Now, I'm super curious about the Galaxy Unpacked event. We're expecting to see not just the Galaxy S25 Ultra, but also the S25 and S25 Plus. There's even some buzz about a potential Galaxy S25 Slim. It's all a bit exciting and nerve-wracking, honestly. I mean, who doesn't love a good surprise reveal? And with the One UI 7 beta code floating around, it's like, what else are they planning? The anticipation is palpable. So, to wrap it all up, the excitement surrounding the Galaxy S25 Ultra is really building up. I can feel it in the air, and I'm sure you can too. Make sure to keep an eye out for more developments as we get closer to the event. And hey, if you're as pumped as I am, don't forget to like, subscribe, and drop a comment below with your thoughts. What are you most excited about? Honestly, just thinking about all these features and improvements makes me feel hopeful. Like, in a world where everything can feel so overwhelming, it's nice to have something to look forward to. You know, it's a reminder that innovation keeps moving forward, and that's something to be grateful for. So, let's keep this conversation.